Last time we had an exciting adventure, and now we're having another exciting adventure. Namely, we're gonna go to the other side of the boat. Cool. <laughs> Last time we beat up some tanks, destroyed a tank depot, did a whole bunch of stuff, really. those prisoners. Man, this level's heavy on the landmarks, isn't it? Got a lot of hundreds, too. It's like a hundred for the prison. We can't actually escape from this. Like, we're stuck here. Like, if we could just rotate the control stick or something like that, like, something that's a little easier to do than having to tap a button a whole bunch. Like, I'm getting my early RSI in right now. are uh, a whopping 180 seconds. This game is pretty generous with time, but then again, it's not really meant to be a difficult game. It's not, it's not meant to be a real thigh slapper. Let's, 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 let's go! Let's, 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 let's go! We've got 180 seconds for dropping into a new foreign area. For some reason, the music's still going. You'd think this would be, like, a good time to have the music cut out for a little bit, and be like, oh, you're in a spooky new place. But no, it's like, eh. Eh. Silos complete. Prophecy fulfilled. Should have failed that. Should have failed that. Because then I can pick up this Henry Styles. Now it's bad. Just need a lick of color. I need a lick of color and a jump that jumps. This works so much. Like when I last time I mentioned that the reason this works a lot better in the in the Wii version is that in the Wii version, um, I said something about the trigger being a little bit more trigger. What I actually meant is the nunchucks trigger. Uh, is very brief. It's like a, it's a button. It's not like it's not a thing you can do uh, pressure sensitive stuff with. It is a button, and you push the button. Um, okay, so that's a, I thought there would be something up there, but no. So yeah, it's it's a button in the in the Wii version. So it's a little bit easier to do this, but with a, with an actual like proper trigger, it's a little bit more frustrating to do. Yes, these are pushers. They just push you. I don't think they do anything else of of, no, of worth or note. We already got done all the trees. I forgot about that part. <laughs> No, no need to worry about them trees. And now we're getting to an area that's actually kind of uh Welcome to traversal is the problem. Actually, I mean, that never really makes jumping too hard. It always gives you something to cling to. I 
And no, I haven't eaten anything today, and I don't plan to eat anything today. I just don't have any hunger. And I don't think I'm gonna get any either. I wonder what those were called in development. The the little the, the little minor things that give you ten points for just clicking it, you know. Like those must have had a name internally. Like boppums and suckums. Quickies. I bet you there's someone somewhere who's like super excited that I'm painting these things too. Like like this, and he's like, oh man, I intended for them to do that. Oh, that's so cool. Okay. I'm sorry, what? Oh my god, you want the pipe screen and the machines. Now we get a little, there's a little bit more of a touchy mission, as you can see. Gotta be very careful with how we move our butts. We might accidentally set ourselves back a bit. And this is how he bounces. Like, whoever made that bounce, you did a good job. Give yourself a pat on the back. Whoever you are, wherever you are, however you go. Oh, goodness. Oh, goody goodness. I'm dying. He's a nice trail of black. That's a walk of shame if I ever saw one. I like this. I like how we have to get up here and all we do here is to, to... Oh, there's a mission up here. Okay. Where are the rest of the Radiants? I don't think we're going to see any more Radiants at this point. Oh, it's a one-directional thing, huh? That damn is huge. Well, let's go take care of some missions then. <laughs> you sure you want to stand there, Blop? You sure you want to stand right there? is right here like hey how you do make this on the way from a car court, this mission's actually kind of a of a bother this mission ain't for the faint of heart as they say for the fainted of heart. I don't know why Blob has a crouch button, by the way. Do not ask me this question. I do not have an answer. I don't think it's ever used. Like, there's never a situation in which you need to crouch to get it in one. But it's a feature nonetheless, so... Got it in one. I, 
I, I really do think it's impressive they used filters the way they did, because I'm pretty sure the Wii doesn't have that strong of a... isn't, like, that good at it. So, let's go pick up that color energy so that we're well energized for the job. What do you got, Professor? We get a whopping four minutes to do this job. Don't forget, by the way, that you share your timer. So if you run out of conventional timer time... color all over the place. Yeah, it gives you a 30. It's like, hey, listen. I hope you're nice and familiar with those hexagons, because I'm pretty sure they're a recurring element of this game. you extra time too. It's like, you don't get four minutes. You get a lot more. But yeah, I recall there being a mission in which there are a lot of hexagonical platforms. They're pretty bland looking, so you can understand those levels themselves. Like, eh. They're good for, like, nice color missions, though. Anyway, with the power of color, the dam now looks pretty good, and there's giant fish swimming between them. I'm going to need a rain check on that. Okay. That's cute. I got Challenger. Now we gotta start figuring out where the remaining paint as targets are. Itch my nose. So what do we miss? What do we have progress? I don't think we have the style. Oh, we got all the styles. We don't have all the billboards, though. Don't have all the billboards. Oh, there's a, a target. A juicy target I missed. And my nose that itches. Ba ba ba! Really, these little nodules. I'm sneeze. No, oh, my nose! Why is my nose like this right now? Wait, there's nothing out here that I missed? I wish this thing showed up. Pointed out billboards and stuff. That's the information I need right now, because I'm pretty sure I only missed one billboard. Best keep the old peepers open, then. Because I do want to get as many objectives as I can. I'm not, I don't intend to do a 100% run, but I do. I do kind of want to give all these levels a good run. Yeah, I'll give them all a little bit of little, 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 little love. Super slow. I don't know why. Oh, 
Huh. Would this have just been something that got deeply painted? There it is. No, we just won reward. Aha! So whatever my last target is, it's gonna give me the last radiance, and then I'll have 100% of this mission, except for time. It's gotta be that way. If it's any other way, I'll be like, what? Then I missed the gradients themselves. Yeah, I missed the I missed some gradients somewhere. Great. Great, excellent, fantastic, amazing. Luckily, we know that those buggers are in a very localized area on this mission. Look how ra radiants are just sit around in one place. They just kind of move around a bit, and they're like, ah, I want to go home. That one's for you, in case you were wondering. Let's get back. And we just gotta look for some very sad looking gray blobs on the ground. And I don't mean the blob blobs. simple they kept the double lobs design. It's just a big old blob. But with some recognizable features that he would possibly trademark. They put in jobs <laughs> to make him legal. Where the heck are these guys? They're out of here, little snooty buggers. Seriously, where are these guys? And with that, I think I basically super clear this mission. One to go, and that is the final door. Almost half a million points. Look at that. Look at that. Well, after this, I just gotta do those secret levels, and I'll have uh, enough videos to last me. If I was uh, Agent York, I'd be getting a lot of uh, vandalism penalties. I wonder how many color splatters it actually total remembers before it starts erasing them. are still there. They're still like, hey, look, we got this. And it's like, ah, don't feel bad for them if you ever shut them down. <laughs> They're all angry. So what is the perfect time for this one? Yeah! 18 minutes! I guess if I didn't spend so much time loafing around, you could do it in 18 minutes. We got a story level, Guggentras Island. We can free, free paint in Chroma Dam, and we have a cutscene. We look at Ink Academy and Crane Fighting. Next time, we'll take a look at those secret missions.